Uh, hey, man, you uh, you ready to host this talk show, huh? I'm ready to host it. I'm ready to host Weed Night. Fuck yeah. Weed well, Night. Yo, we're good friends. So I just want to let you know, I have a gift for you. You have a gift for me? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Yeah. We got we to gotta just make something clear about Weed Night. This week, oh, this Weed Night is going to be the weedest and the nightest of the Weed Nights. Perfect. Perfect. Now, I know there's one thing you've been wanting to do for years. There is, there is. You're right. you've, been, you've, you've wanted to be the one-man band for a late-night talk show instead of the host. Like, exactly. your whole life. Exactly. Well, guess what? Tonight's what? your chance. Whoa! Whoa! Uh, keep doing whoa. Whoa. whoa! Oh my god! What? 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 Oh. Your guitar turned into a keyboard. Yeah, you get to be the musical guest tonight. How awesome is that? That is awesome. Hold on, it's still unplugged. Oh, <laughs> that's. Forgot. Yeah, that's... you didn't. Can you send me the plug? Can you send me the plug? Oh yeah. Whoa! Whoa! It's hard to find the plug from back here. I'll just stand up for a second. I found Whoa. it. Oh. Okay. Yeah, let me let me tell you. Yeah, there, there's only one thing I've been wishing I could. I do. know, I know, and Hunter. You know, it's really weird that you did this to me because I have a plan for you. Oh my God! What? What? You've always wanted to be a talk show host, hadn't you? I've always, always. In your many years as being the one man band in Weed Night with Michelle O'Shawn, you've always been, dreamed of the day would say Weed Night with Hundy the band. I've always said that. But tonight's that night, man. You're the host. You mean I get to be the host? Yes, you get to be the host. Uh, I'm gonna pass the hosting papers to you. The script. Okay. Here we go. Wow, it disappeared. <laughs> you got it. That's it. You're the host now, man. Hunter? Oh, I'll, of course. I'll play you on. I'll play you on. Of course. Of course. Of course. I'll play you on. With a, that amazing intro theme. Give it up for Hunter! Exactly. Uh, Hunter. Hunter. I can't hear you, man. I can't hear you. I can't. Can, can you try speaking up louder? Louder? No, 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 dude. I think. Oh my God. I was told about this. My my mom my mom told me that this would happen. Hunter, you have just done the gift of the Magi. That's right. You gave me the keyboard and I got what I wanted, but because, you, because you're the protagonist, I gave you the chance to host, but your microphone, you gave it to me here. You're on mute. Exactly. What, what that word you just said, which I cannot say. No, dude, come on, come on. This is live. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta roll with it. Come on. Um, Come on, you got to roll with it. You can do this. You can do this. Yeah. Yeah, the applause, applause. Oh, people in the comments are applauding like crazy. Do a joke. Do a joke. Oh man, that you're one cool cat hunter. <laughs> you're <a> cool cat. <laughs> now that's a killer joke. Tell us another one, honey. Tell us another one. Do a topical joke. Do a topical joke. Ah, oh, 
you got him. You got him. Oh, you're one cool cat hunter. <laughs> You got him, man. You got him. Uh, I guess we're just going to be doing this for the rest of the night. <laughs> uh, hey, what's up? It's me, uh, Alan Johnson, NYU MFA, uh, UCB mod team. Um, I wrote seven videos for Crack.com in 2016, and I was a varsity uh, athlete uh, in high school. Just wanted to get some of my credentials out of the way. And... Right. Um, you know, we're having tech problems. I don't know if Hunty can can host tonight. So uh, we have no. a different host. Uh, it's freaking Spider-Man. Let's get Spider-Man out here. Oh, my God. It's Spider-Man. Wow. Let's play that classic Spider-Man theme. Thank you. Thank you so much, Alan. Oh, man. This is exciting. I've always wanted to host. I have, I have some big news. It might have to do with the fact that I'm not wearing a mask. Uh, some very exciting news, but let's, I guess let's do a monologue. Yeah, let's do a monologue, man. Let's do it. All right. Uh, so, uh, so I guess the only day in LA you can't find any potholes is 420. Funny joke, yeah. man. <laughs> no, that, that one was, uh, that one kind of tanked, but, uh, we can, I can live with it. Anyways, I'm just going to move on to my first guest, who I'm super excited to have here with me. It's my girlfriend, MJ. Oh, MJ. Hey, Tiger. Tiger oh. one and Tiger two. <laughs> hey, MJ. Rawr. Wow. Brar. Oh. <laughs> Rawr. It's a Tiger Fest. Oh, somebody call Ruth Baskin. Uh. Carol Baskin. Man, see? Oh, Baskin Robbins. Carol Baskin. Yes. Yeah. I, I got your joke. I got your joke, man. Late night jitters. Late night jitters. And MJ, you have a, a movie coming out. Uh yeah, I do. Um Oh Henry. Called... What was that? Oh Henry? Is that what it is? Oh Henry, yes, yes. Um, oh Henry, it's a uh, it's an anthology. Mm. Um got a bunch of different stories all in one, and it's gonna be great. Coming to a theater near you, 2021. Wow. That's going to be amazing. I'm so proud. I'm so happy. I'm so happy for you, MJ. You Me just, too. You I'm crazy. happy too, MJ. <laughs> you're, you're a one cool cat. If I'm a tiger, you're a cat. <laughs> <laughs> hey, tiger. Watch it with the cat jokes. You're like like one. Cat, you know? I can only come um, cat jokes. Oh, anyways. I have some exciting news to tell you. Mm -hmm. I got you a gift. Oh my! I got you a gift. Oh my God! Double gift. Really? Yeah, that's so weird. Oh my God! What? Do you want to trade? Huh? Do you want to? Should we do like a countdown so we can give our, each other our gifts at the same time? Let's do it. Let's do it. Well, no, I want to hear your gift first. I, I, I mean, the the host says it. The host wants to hear the gift first. It's good. Yeah, go. yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, the guest gets to go first. All right. Um, okay. You want some drum eyes. rolls? Do you want some okay. drum rolls? I'll take some drum rolls. Yes, thank you. All right. Oh my it's so god! ID. I found it on the ground. I I thought it would mean something to you, so. Oh um, my god. I know how yeah. that. I remember how upset you got, you know, the it's night. Amazing. I know when I found oh, someone else's awesome. idea. That's yeah, amazing. you're so afraid that somebody had stolen your identity. Uh yeah, I mean they did. They still have my identity. I found someone else's though, so I figured karma, I can oh, steal their identity oh. and then you know, you I think I'll get mine this? back somehow that way. Oh, 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 oh. Honey, I feel terrible. I I sold my secret identity to Dr. Octopus to get you to the front of the line at the DMV with paperwork for a new identity. Oh, man. Why not wearing the mask anymore? Spider-Man, dude, that's not cool. Technically, that's not cool. I thought you had just gotten into it. I also sold him the rights to the name Spider-Man. What? Oh. Yeah. So what are you going to call yourself, man? You know, like, 
I was thinking I was going to call myself like like Action Man, or but I realized the trademark actually actually also applies to the word man. So I have to use the word boy. So I was kind of thinking like Sticky Boy. Look out, you guy who lives around in this township because I he also has your friendly neighborhood Spider Man too. So it's a guy who lives in your township. Sort of maybe. Spider Man, look, I'm your, I'm your, I'm your band member. I'm here for you, bro. That shit sucks. It you does. cannot take that name. I, I don't think that's a good name for you. Honestly, it makes me um, want to end this relationship right here, right now. Even just you thinking of that idea. Oh boy, this is really, uh, really weird. It's kind of awkward. To it's tell you what, how, how about, how about a play? Ooh. How about I play a nice song for for the, the lovely couple? Couple, how about that? Oh, fantastic! Absolutely. Yeah. Here we go. That's about it. That's all I know how to play. Oh, I like how familiar. Like it sounds. It sounds like something from like our childhood. You know, I think that's a really great way to to bring our relationship back to life. Um, You guys gotta connect your MJ and Spider. Yeah, Spider MJ. Well, well, but now he's not. I know he's changing his name to Sticky Boy. It doesn't have to be Sticky Boy. Can't be Sticky Boy. How about loads of web? Loads of web. Mm. Loads, loads of, web. of web. Loads of web with an apostrophe. Yeah. Right. It sounds very metal. Exactly. Loads of web. Yeah, and you yeah. shoot web all over the place. Yeah, I, I do. So you do all the things Spider Man does, but we're just going by a different name now. Absolutely. That's... Right. Right. Your costume's got to be different too, though. You're... Yes, yeah, I can put a, I guess a big web on it. Just no thing. Here's the thing. I think you should go for the totally opposite. Okay. You should pay for the opposite. You wear Spider Man. You wear a costume. Now you're gonna be loads of web, and you're gonna be naked. Mm. Think about that. Mm. We're, we're, a- we're, ta- we're taking the box. We're flipping it upside down. Where's the box? Where's the inside? The outside? It's you know what? I think I'm okay with people knowing my identity without knowing my religious preference. If you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh. Ah. That's funny, man. That's funny. You got it back. You got it back, Spider-Man. Oh, great. Well, maybe this is a good time to to bring on our next guests. Absolutely. Let's uh let's welcome them, Spider-Man. <laughs> Our next guests are here to do a live remote. But meanwhile, while I try to figure out who these guests are, I'd like to take a moment and remind you all to donate to Pac 420 on Venmo. Yes. You should do that. Yes. Please welcome. This says here Caitlin David. Is that the name? Caitlin David? His mother. Oh, it's mother. Oh my God! I'm sorry, mother. I'm sorry. Please go ahead. We will be exchanging gifts in the celebration of the gift of the Magi. Mm-hmm. Okay, my darling. Yes, my love. We had to save money this year in order to get each other something, and I had to sell something very precious to get you this. That's fine. I had to sell something too. It took my father's gold watch, but I got you this antique brush for your beautiful hair that you've always wanted. Oh my goodness, perfect. I'm gonna use it right now. <laughs> did, did you get anything for me? I Actually, yes, I did. It was a little hard to get a hold of because it's so rare, but it is a... Picture vinyl 
of the soundtrack for a little known indie sci-fi film, E.T. the Extraterrestrial. Oh. I don't know if we've had this conversation, but I hate E.T. I, the movie has always terrified me and his face has given me nightmares since my childhood. That's actually a pretty universal reaction. He looks like a bike seat with an earth form for a neck. So. What did you have to sell like, to afford this? A record player. What? Okay, but don't actually don't get too upset about it because I was able to listen to this before purchase. Unplayable. Unplayable. It's just a cacophony of hisses, pops, scratches. It's maybe one trill of, uh, of John Williams, but otherwise it's probably the worst thing I've ever heard in the world. So in that way, it's kind of a win. And I was thinking we could frame it and hang it up. Oh, that's a wonderful idea. This moon site is so beautiful and it'll go great over there on our wall. Absolutely not. Why not? Okay, well, first of all, that side, that's the Ambling Production logo and I don't want to give them free advertising because I don't have any loyalty to them. I'm not really a big Amblin man. You were not born an Amblin man? No, and I have no interest of being raised into one. So I really genuinely feel in my heart it should be oh. this little fella looking out at us. He looks like somebody waxed the Grinch. Take another look into those soulful blue orbs and really think about it. Put them in a nice frame hang him over our television. We don't have a mantle, but we can still pretend he's like our dead son. And every time you watch like a really funny sitcom, we can be like, ah, oh, he would have loved that. He would have found that really funny. And when we have to make a big life decision, we can touch his picture and say, I wish you were here, bud. You would know what to do. But like everyone would know. You would know, I would know, the cat would know. All the viewers at home would know. He would have no idea what to do. He's not from these parts. He's from space. All of our customs are weird. He's just a botanist going around looking for samples. Wait, is he canonically a botanist? Is that a real fact? I, I think so. No, yes, he absolutely is. Because they show inside of his ship, and it's basically a greenhouse that could go warp speed. It's super humid. And then they land in the middle of the woods. And that's when he goes out and he starts collecting samples. And while he's doing that, the ship takes off without him because I guess they didn't do head count or whatever. And he's left alone in the woods. It's dark. He's alone on a friendly face for miles. We've all been there. That is a universal childhood experience. You can relate. I can relate. And then he is nothing but his wits out there in the dark. His wits and a local boy child with whom he can only communicate through gesture and niche candy. And then eventually you kind of end up robbing your boy child companion's mom and younger sister so you can MacGyver a deep space payphone out of a speak and spell. And Kalen, Kalen, Kalen. He looks like if the eraser head baby had lived. <laughs> he's a hero. He's a hero. And in fact, I'm gonna go further. I'm gonna say he's an everyman. Because who among us has not found themselves on the run from the feds? Who among us has not found themselves falling off the side of the road, tumbling into a little ditch where ice cold rainwater drifts past you, pooling in the crevices of your pallid, almost corpse body because you are so sick, because the, the atmosphere of the earth is super inhospitable to you, so you are so ill, and the boy child that you've been robbing with, he's also sick because he has a soul bond with you. And then you find yourself in your adoptive family's home, which has now been turned into a fumigation tent, while a bunch of feds are trying to do surgery on you. And speaking of your adoptive family, they all have to wear hazmat suits just to be near you. They're terrified. And a ton of children have to grow up way too fast to come and rescue you and take you from the clutches of the feds. And they all get on bikes that start flying because of you. And they take you back to the clearing where you were left behind so you can get, get busy on the aforementioned MacGyvered Deep space payphone made from a speaking spell and assorted other very 80s items so your fucking interns can fly back for you in that greenhouse from the sky. Did this happen to you? No, but I dream of it and so should you. As an American, this should be a dream of yours to live the life of a scientist, curious and bold and malformed Heavily dependent on children. My love, I know this 
means a lot to you and that you spent a lot of money on it. But I have to be honest, I hate this gift. Well, actually, no, there was uh, so much money left over from the record players. So I actually went out. I think you're going to like this. I went out and I bought this chain which is gonna be perfect for hanging that antique watch of yours that you're so proud of. But I sold that gold watch so that I could afford the brush. That is so stupid. That was an heirloom, why would you do that? <laughs> I, I, applause, applause noise. It's supposed to be applause. A applause, <laughs> oh. You're Michelle. talking. Okay, I'm back. Yes. Okay. Cool. You know what? What? You're doing a hell of a job. Oh, man, thank you. Listen, um, but just between us, I think you're doing a hell of a job, too, even though, you know, you're muted and nobody could hear you and you yeah. kind of almost uh, got us canceled. But I think you're doing a great job, too. Yeah. Oh, well, which part almost got us canceled? Um, all of it. Anyway. <laughs> okay, good, 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 yeah, good, good, good. Um, are you having fun being both a band leader and filling in for me? Hunter, let me tell you something. I am having so much fun. I don't want the fun to stop. Nor do I. I don't want it to stop. I want it to keep going. Yeah. There can't be another tech issue in this show immediately following this. There's no way. Absolutely not. In fact, I can. I am willing to say that if there is any tech issues, I will personally pay each person in the chat a thousand dollars. Don't do that. Don't do I that. I actually will not do that. Don't I just thought that. about it, and it is a very bad idea. I will pay them a high five. Actually, that's also a bad idea because of the pandemic. That's. I will pay them respect. Respect. Do you want you want to keep going and announce our next? Uh, I want to keep going, and I'm gonna uh, play. The I theme. actually, I actually what? want to jump in again. Uh, it's me again, Alan Johnson. Uh, in addition to my prior credits, I also almost got a writing job with uh, Crooked Media. But then the next day after the interview, I did tweet out something mean about John Lovett, and presumably did not get the job because of that. Uh, I just want to talk more about what the what we're doing tonight. We're Venmoing at PAC 420 to donate to the Last Prisoner Project. You help all the uh, – <laughs> okay, I don't know what the rest of that sentence, but uh, please donate. We've They've made a lot of money so far tonight, so uh, give it a shot. And um, if you see uh, any of the pod save guys around, tell them to give me a second chance. I will toe the line uh, for money. So I'm uh, going to jump out now, but just wanted to say that. Oh, they, should I, do a, they should do a new show called Alan Saves America. Because you're going to do it, Alan. You're going to do it. Not bad. That's true. Awesome. Hunter, are uh, you ready to get the yeah, party absolutely. moving? Absolutely. And, and uh, yes, please, please do donate. That is what this whole 17 hours of amazing uh, what we're doing here is. Please, thank you. We Anyway, it's a pot night. Um, you're hosting. Yes, exactly. And if you donate, if 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 the gloves donate, you must not be a reprobate. Anyway, that was perfect. Got it on one go. Here's our next guest. Now you loved him last time he was here, but he's back. Animal tricks with chest of old. Don't know about that, chest devil. <laughs> what was that? What, what was that? Chess Devil had some crazy audio, but Chess, I'm going to assume you're good now. I'm going to put you right back in, Chess Devil. Let's see how it Let, goes. Let's do that again. Let's soon be the song. Here's the song. Come on in, Chess Devil. Okay, he's not ready yet. All right, Chess Devil, you got to fix that, Chess Devil. You got to fix that audio, Chess Devil. We can't have that. We can't have that audio, Chess Devil. You know, while we wait, Hunter, how about we do some of our classic banter? Oh, ab absolutely, yeah, because this is not our first time doing this show before. Absolutely not. Absolutely uh, not. Ask me what I did today. What did you do today? I did nothing. What did oh, you do today, Hunter? I went to urgent care where I got to deal with my own gift of the Magi, where I had a doctor tell me that I should stop smoking weed. 
<gasps> Technically, it was a nurse, but yeah, that's that's that, sad. that actually happened today. Uh, yes, please do donate. At okay, let's try again. Chest devil. Yes, try again. And, chest and, devil. And, and and let's. I think the problem is Chess Devil doesn't have uh, the great, the best audio setup. So donate to Pack Four Twenty, <laughs> and we will match that for Chess Devil to buy a uh, microphone. We'll give him a snowball mic. A blue yeti uh, is equivalent to the donations we get for the last Prisoner Project. So let's let's get that going. I think we're ready for Chess Devil. Let's. Wait, hold on. Uh, okay. Chess so Devil. Before we get Chess Devil, I just want to just explain what happened. So. You know how hot it's been? Yeah. I got my second shot, and that fed into fucking heat exhaustion or some shit. And I have an anxiety, so that doubled up on that. So I'm chilling and watching all my friends do a great show, and I'm just having a fucking blast. And thank you all for being here, watching, donating, <coughs> and being in the show. <laughs> God damn it, Brother Wags. Uh, but yes, that is why I took a step back. Thank you all so much. And give it up for Michelle for literally on the day of not knowing that you were going to host a show and you're hosting a show and you're fucking kicking ass. So please clap, clap, clap in the chat for Michelle. Hunter, Hunter, I bet you're surprised to hear this, but I've actually been a talk show host for the past 50 years. Uh, you might well, have known true. me under a different you're name. My name was uh, Johnny Carson. What? Yes, that's who I was. Uh, okay, and, here, uh, and, and it was wild. It was crazy and wild. <laughs> it was wild and crazy, guys. I don't, I'm not sure if that's a good Johnny Carson impression, but that's about the be best I can do. No, 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 no. That wasn't a Johnny Carson impression. That was a you doing you. And I exactly that. I've also, I was also many other hosts. I've been Jay Leno. <laughs> I've been Jimmy Fallon. Uh, this is great. This is good. This is amazing. This is great. I've been Craig Ferguson. Oh, he's stealing my bit. This is literally a Craig Ferguson bit. And that's all the hosts I know. No, I'm that's all the hosts you've been. That's all the hosts I've been. Exactly, Hunter. Yes. <sighs> okay. Uh, is it is Chess Devil ready? Wait, before we vote, we got Chess. <laughs> you think the creators of a keyboard ever imagined that like an idiot would be doing this? <laughs> like, like I want to make an instrument that brings joy to people. I, I mean, I mean is, are, are, isn't that like with like the the Moog? Isn't that basically what it always was from the beginning? Dude, can I break character for a second? I love Moog. It's so good. <laughs> you didn't have to break character. To, to I know. I know. Moog. I love it when they go. Do, do, do. That's I, I when they do that. I go. Whoa! That's my shit. All right, Chess Devil, are you ready? I'm going to take that as a yes. Hey, Chess Devil, better. <laughs> ah, awesome. I apologize, ladies and gentlemen. I do apologize to that and this wonderful, wonderful show we have here. Thank you, Michael. Thank you, Hunter, for having me on the show. Unfortunately, we are having other technical problems, so there's more respect that you have to pay to the chat. My webcam is not working, so you cannot see my beautiful English bulldog I have for you today. But don't worry. I will let you know what's happening. So these are going to be uh, uh, like uh, pet tricks. Yes, but, yes. But we won't be able to watch them is what you're yeah, saying. Yeah, correct. But I definitely have them ready. I will describe everything that's happening for you. So you're right here with me in my do, living room. Do, do you want some music? Uh, yeah. Sure, sure. Uh, so I'm going to bring out my, 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 my friend here. This is uh, my English bulldog. He is 47 pounds, about 10 years old. Ladies and gentlemen, can we get a warm welcome for Dr. Meatballs, OBGYN. All right, Doc. Thank you. All right, Dr. Meatballs. So for your first trick, I need you to sit. And he's sitting, ladies and gentlemen, sitting right here. Clap, 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 clap. All right, clap, Dr. Clap, clap. Meatballs. Now, Dr. Dr. Meatballs OBGYN has a special gift. He can find it? peanut butter wherever you hide it. So, Michael or Hunter, tell me, where should I hide this peanut butter? I don't think I can say my answer on, on air. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, I'm going to say because I'm a, I'm a nice Jewish fella. 
I'm, I'm going to think like it's an Afi Komen, and I'm going to say, like, on, on the shelf, but a little high so that the kids won't see it immediately. A little high. All right. All right. I'm going over to my bookshelf. We got the peanut butter right there. All right. I'm coming back. All right, Dr. Meatballs, OBGYN, are you ready? Fantastic. Go find the peanut butter. All right, he's walking down the hall right now. Up oh, past the bookshelf. He is coming back. Oh, and he's found the peanut butter. Yeah. Yeah, good job. Clap, clap, clap. Clap, clap, clap. clap, clap, clap. clap, clap Fantastic, clap. fantastic. All right, we're going to do it one more time. Where should can I hide can it I make, now? Can I make a suggestion? Because Hunter is a nice Jewish fella, but I, I'm a little mean Jewish fella. I'm a mean Jewish fella. And I want you to hide it uh, on the on the window. I want you to hide it on the window. On the windowsill, yeah. like the cooling pie. No problem. All Very right, mean and Jewish. Got mean, peanut butter. Mean Jewish. All right, Dr. Meatball, sit. Good job. All right. We're going to the windowsill. All right. It's on the windowsill. Coming back. All right, Dr. Meatballs. Find the peanut butter. Okay. He's going down the hall. Up the stairs. Nope, nope. He's coming back down. All right. He's going to... No, not in the bathroom, Dr. Meatballs. Up, up. He's on the windowsill. And... Oh, yeah, Dr. Meatballs. Yeah, Dr. Meatballs found that peanut butter. What? Oh, Dr. Meatballs has found that peanut butter so well. Yeah, you find that peanut butter, Doctor. I don't hear him pinging up against any glass or... Oh, or no. Oh, 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 no. He's found the peanut butter. Yeah. You know, get get Chess Devil butter. out of here. Get Chess Devil out of here. Dr. Uh, Meatballs, no! Dr. Get Chess no! Devil out of here. Oh, God, Dr. Meatballs! Bad peanut butter! Bad peanut butter! <laughs> Is he dead? Did he die? He deserved that. Good. Good riddance. Hey, let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. Yeah, exactly. Oh, we have $400 donated. You know what? Let's get 420 before the next act is over. What do you say? Tell you what. Tell you what. Whoever donates for 420, I will compose a song for them live. And that is not, I will not play a song back. I will make a song for you live. I, I think Brother Wags is right. Uh, I think that's a great idea. Exactly. So come to donate right now if you want to hear a song being made up live out of my head about you. Okay. So you donate. We're going to go to our next act, which just so happens to be our musical guest. You're our one-man band. This is our musical guest. Give it up for Reptar. Oh, yeah. Look at that, Reptar. Yes, yes. It is I, Reptar. Yeah, Everyone give him the full screen. Everyone say it now. We want Reptar. We want, we want Reptar. Reptar. We want Reptar. Thank yeah. you. We want, we want Reptar. We want Reptar. We want Reptar. We want Reptar. We got it. We got 420. All right. Uh, All right, Reptar. Yes, now that we've got of Reptar. Now that we've got 420, can nice. you uh, g uh, can you perform for us? Absolutely. Of course I can. You might have seen me perform in Reptar on Ice. I will be performing something along those lines. Uh, I believe I've, I've got a musical accompaniment. Exactly, you do, my brother. Okay, got... perfect. So uh, whenever you're ready, I'm ready to perform. By the way, I love that Reptar has his phone Venmoing the pack right now in his hand. No, that's not it. That's not it. Don't ruin, don't kayfabe, my brother. That is uh, <laughs> that is his uh, dinosaur boat. I, I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> I don't know what the phone is. Here we go. Here we go. I'm ready whenever you are, Reptar. <laughs> I'm ready. All right, here we go. Hold on a second. Uh, yeah, all right, here we go. <clears throat> there was an old man from Cape Horn 
who wished he had never been born. So he sat on a chair till he died of despair, that delorious man of Cape Horn. Amazing. Um, there was a young lady whose bonnet came untied when the bird sat upon it. But she said, I don't care, all the birds in the air are welcome to sit on my bonnet. Ah, that is music. That is music. There was a young person in green who seldom was fit to be seen. She wore a long shawl over bonnet and all, which developed that person in green. Ah, uh, hey, that's that you. Is, that is and amazing. That's, that is that is the voice and power of Reptar, ladies and gentlemen. You're very welcome. Amazing. Clap, clap, clap. Yes. Clap, clap, clap for Reptar. You sure you don't have any more uh, limericks there? Amazing. That's that's all I got Spider screenshots of. Yes. <laughs> Spider Man, how come you've never written me a song? Oh my! Uh, I don't know about that Spider Man fella. I'm loads of web. Exactly. <laughs> oh, loads of. You're still going with the name change? I I kind of have to. I okay. just kept them business cards. Uh, I mean they were free. I'm getting the first hundred for free, but they do already say loads of That's web. A good deal. You got it. You uh, got it. You got to get them for free. Once hey, it's right on the business minute. card, you can't go back. That's how I. That's how my name changed. Um, hey, from can, Brianna can you, C can to Brianna. Can yeah, we can, we can hear you. We can hear you, Hunter. Don't worry about it, brother. Uh, did anyone else's camera just go out? Uh, no. I don't know. Wow. Mm -hmm. Oh no. No. Oh, okay. Not this is yet. Oh, I keep talking. Oh, mine just mine just oh, went my out. God. Okay. Oh, the strangest thing. Oh my God! What's going on? But, oh! Chess devil, this doesn't count for you, I guess. But, uh, uh, right, but Dr. Meatballs, uh, he's a little busy. Oh my God. He's a little busy. So I'm oh, sorry. Oh my God. I'm back. Okay. okay. No. Oh, it's gone. What? What is happening? I I, I think Mother's camera is about to go down. Bad Mother. Oh, I, I think we're. I, I I I feel pretty good about where we're going today. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my no. God! No! Ah! ah! What? Hello, it's me, Stewie Griffin Garcia Para, baby. That's right. <laughs> It's me, Stewie, Stewie Griffin. I was fucked by a radioactive Nomar Garcia Para. And here I am, Stewie, Stewie Griffin Garcia Para. Now I'm go I'm I'm still I'm stealing the day, baby. Do I make you horny for baseball? Do uh <laughs> He's ready for the drums. It's time to fight, baby. Spider-Man, turn off the dock, baby. It's time to fight. Hello, MJ. Hi, hi, Stewie. Um, uh, please don't hurt me. Um, uh, I can see you're very upset. Are you feeling lucky? Not, not particularly. Spider Man. Spider Man's not going to oh, come here. Load of webs. Load of webs. <laughs> Your new name. David is Ortiz awful. isn't going to come here. And Brian the dog isn't coming here either. Who's coming here? It's just me and oh. you. And it's time to die. <laughs> Not if I die first. Wait. Take this. <gasps> that was me punching you in the cheek. Are you okay, Stewie? I didn't mean to hit you that hard. Hello? Hey guys, we've had a lot of fun today, but, um, you know, on a serious note, I am questioning how my career is going right now, and I do think characters like Stewie Griffin, Garcia Parra, are maybe, are maybe why it's not going in the right place. 
So I just want um, some feedback on that. Um, if you think that's like maybe an off-color character and it's the reason why I can't get representation uh, from anyone and why Pod Save America won't hire me because I did do a self-sabotage. I self-sabotaged with a joke tweet about, it was about like John Favreau talking about getting pussy, you know, and something I, I, I don't even like saying that out loud. So I'm just really at a crossroads here. So, um, you know, uh, I'm going to turn it back over to Hunty. Uh, and, um, you know, I just, you know, let me know if I should leave L.A. <sighs> Hunty. That was too much, man. Yeah. I think there's only. Sorry, go ahead. No, I, I just wanted to, like, uh, toggle through that. I think Sp Spider-Man loads a web is probably dead exactly he's uh, dead i saw his body and then i stepped over it because he was on the way so i mean i haven't heard reptar roar in a while i also stepped over his body are you just playing hopscotch yes and i like that exactly <laughs> what but did Hunter, you I, I just wanted to say you know there's only one way we can end this show or even bring the show to some, something that resembles an end or even continue it. And that is doing that segment we used to do all those times at the end of the all show. All those times. We must sing, Hunter. We must sing that song that you promised to write. Right, of course. That's what I meant. That's what I was going <laughs> to <play. laughs> I'll follow your lead. Yes. Uh, here we go. <laughs> you donated to the pack, and that's where it ends. I hope my friend Carter is not seeing this because he gave me this piano because he wanted me to learn it, and that was a year ago. And did I learn it? No. Now that's I didn't learn piano. A pandemic story. Piano. I go, feel go. really bad and it made me sad, but I didn't learn piano. No, 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 no. I didn't learn piano. No, no, no. I didn't learn to code. No, no, I no. I just stood in my house sucking something that rhymes with code. I didn't learn to cook. I didn't learn to dance. I just stood in my house. Hoping this year would fucking end. Oh my god, I didn't learn how to play piano. He didn't learn to play piano. I didn't learn to play piano. Didn't learn, didn't learn. And this was where the guitar riff would be, but I also didn't learn how to play guitar. So that's it. It's just that, you know, if it was going to happen for me, it probably would have happened already, you know. It's it's almost like I've sunk um sunk a lot of time into this career that's really going nowhere. And um you know, I might have to go I mean, I'm gonna take off the stupid fucking hat. I don't even like the Red Sox, but um you know it just I, I don't think I'm gonna uh Be a Yankee fan, be a Yankee fan, be a Yankee fan. You should be a Yankee fan. No, you should do this. Silent night, holy night, all is night. Please donate. We donate to us, and we're going to help people in jail. Donate to Pack for 20 because you know there's bail. Give Thank you so much, Thank you so much, Bert.
donating. Thank you so much for being a part of this. Thank you so much for sending Alan home. Uh, we've had Michelle, Hunty, Alan, Mother, that's David and Kaylin. We got Greg, we got Chess Devil, we got Reptar, and we got Mary Jane. Thank you all so much for being a part of this show. Please keep donating. Please keep watching all night long. Please keep smoking all night long. I am going to sit in front of an air conditioner and hydrate and watch more comedy. Wait, hold on, hold up. What, what, what's next? What's next on the schedule? What, uh, what, uh, what is, is it? It's, uh, <laughs> Thanks, Brother Wags. <laughs> Somebody uh, asked you for a this Despacito. I won't do that. Okay, continue. Uh, uh, the the next one is her High Story, right? High Story. Alan, Let's, wait for, <laughs> Let's <laughs> wait for confirmation. Let's wait for confirmation in the chat. Before I the the street. Street. Is it High Story? Can we get confirmation? Can we get yes. confirmation? I, I, I still got stupid animal tricks if you want them. Um, I have an answer to Grendelson's question. Where did you get that amazing Depeche Mode shirt? I got it from the rummage bin sale at Hot Topic. When they have all the cardboard boxes at their entrance and they don't really want you entering the store. That's where I got awesome. it. $5. All God, right. Idiot. So, okay. <laughs> <Cheap> idiot. <laughs> uh, okay, so... Her story is not directly next. It's at 1030, I believe, uh, Pack Theater, just to confirm. Okay, the next show is Social Cho Justice Cholo and Primo Douglas. That is up next. Check that shit out. I will be fucking watching. Let's fucking watch. Let's donate. Let's party all fucking night. Then let's watch Hi Her Story. Then let's watch whatever's after that. And then by the end of it, we'll have really red eyes. Does anyone else have anything else to say? Uh, I'm having a garage sale, uh, so please come by. My address is 360 Masaya Street, and tune in to go sketch yourself this Friday for the third digit of Vern Troyer's social security number. <laughs> 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 Thank you, everyone. Stick around and donate.